what is going on everybody today i'm going to show you guys the best way to record gameplay on your pc now this is going to be using nvidia's geforce shadow play software so this actually will only work for those of you guys who have these geforce gtx class uh, gpus so um, these are included is the uh, 900 700 600 series as well as the 900 800 700 and 600 mobile series so for those of you guys who have an older card, an older Nvidia card or an AMD card, this method is not going to work for you. But I will include in the description a video that I made a while ago showing a few other methods that um, allow you to record gameplay or your desktop on your computer. Um, so I'll link that video in the description for those of you guys who don't have one of these specific cards. But anyways, if you do have this card, this is definitely the best possible way to do so. Um, and it actually is a free method and it has a very minimal effect on FPS and quality of your video. So this is going to give you the highest quality possible video that you can get while still retaining a lot of frame rates. So it's very easy to support. All you need is, uh, you know, a regular uh, CPU. It actually does work with um, AMD CPUs as well because it doesn't really need the CPU as much. Um, because it is a hardware accelerated uh, software. So it actually uses the GPU instead of the CPU to record. Um, which results in much higher frame rates during in-game playing. So um, before you guys go ahead and download this, um, all you have to do really is go up to your computer and open up your GeForce uh, Experience, your NVIDIA GeForce Experience app. So for those of you guys who already have a, uh, an NVIDIA graphics card, in most cases you will already have this software on your computer. If you don't, you can go ahead and download it from, the, uh, from this website right here. But anyways, once you have this open up on your opened up on your computer, all you have to do is go over here to shadow play and then um, this means that it's on I'm actually recording with the software right now so uh, all you have to do is flip this switch on and you can change a few settings here but um, basically the general uh, easy way to do it is press alt F10 and that will save the last um, eight minutes I have it set to eight minutes you can have it up to five or even up to 20 minutes um, so pretty much if you have this uh, application this shadow play running in the background you'll see a small square in the bottom right hand corner of your screen and that pretty much means that shadow play is on and that it's it's shadowing your gameplay so if you press alt f10 it'll pretty much save the last eight minutes or the last 20 minutes of gameplay that you have um, that you've been playing so that's a really cool thing to do I pretty much always have shadow play on just in case something cool happens in a game and I want to uh, you know save it to my hard drive or whatever um, but I also have it in shadow plus manual mode, meaning that if I press alt F9, it's actually going to actively record my screen so I don't have to, you know, go back and record the eight minutes and then find where, you know, find where, um, what part I wanted or anything. So that's usually the way that I use it, but shadow mode is still um, a very cool feature as well. And uh, it records at 60 FPS, 50 megabits per second, and it actually encodes it with a uh, H.264 um, video encoder, which is pretty cool. The file sizes aren't huge. As you can see, eight minutes is three gigabytes, which I think is pretty reasonable, um, especially since you're getting pretty high quality out of it. Anyways, guys, I'll show you guys some gameplay here on screen. I use pretty much all, uh, all my videos use this software to record it. Um, so everybody is in pretty much 1080p 60 frames per second. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, I'd really appreciate a like on it. If you guys use this method, um, leave in the comment section below how it works for you. If you guys would recommend it, I definitely would. This is definitely the best um, recording software that I've seen in a while. It's been out for over a year now, um, but it is still the best possible recording software. Anyways guys, hope you enjoyed. Subscribe to my channel if you guys are new, and I'll see you guys later. Have a good day. Oh, 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 oh,